Thank you. Hey, Trisha, good morning. How are you? Good morning. I'm well. How are you? I'm doing very well. Thank you. I appreciate the time. Absolutely. Thank you for having me. Yeah, most definitely. Well, everything's okay on your end. We'll, we'll go ahead and hit the record button. We'll knock it out. Okay, that uh, sounds perfect. All right. Well, Trisha, again, I, I appreciate the time. Obviously, we are about a week and a half away from Christmas, and I know a lot of people are, are anxious and getting all their shopping done. Before we get to make sure they get their stuff on time, can you tell me a little bit about come the, the hottest trends and, and gifts that you've seen so far this year? Yes, I have got some amazing last minute tech gift ideas for everyone on your list. Whether you're planning an all day trail ride, working on the job site, or juggling maybe a phone with groceries and kids in hand, Kia Sarah's Durasport 5G on Verizon handles it all. This is a rugged but slim Android smartphone, and it's built to military grade specs. So tested to withstand drops of up to five feet onto concrete and waterproof to a depth of six and a half feet for up to 30 minutes. It has an expansive 6.1 inch Gorilla Glass 6 scratch resistant display, is dust proof and is resistant to extreme temperatures, shock and so much more. It is fit for work, play and every day. It is fit for just about any adventure you can throw at it, which is just so awesome. And if you happen to be shopping for any video game enthusiasts on your list, I personally play quite a bit of video games and as a gamer, I always need more storage. The Samsung 980 Pro with heatsink is a solid state drive that enables gamers to expand storage on their console easily and comes ready for installation in Sony's PlayStation 5, which is another hot gift idea this holiday season. The drive boasts lightning fast upload speeds, allowing for fast game launches and sustained performance, allowing users to play games for hours without any performance degradation at all. And for laptop and PC gamers, they can achieve the same great gaming performance with the standard 980 Pro without the heat sink. Now you may be thinking, Trisha, these are fantastic individual gifts, but what about a gift for the whole family, right? The Acer Chromebook Spin 311 is a convertible Chromebook that's super versatile thanks to the 360 degree hinges. And no matter what mode it's being used in, scrolling and swiping is super enjoyable on the responsive 11.6 inch touchscreen display, which is made of antimicrobial corn and gorilla glass, so very high end. It has a built-in high def webcam with a wide angle field of view, so it's great for whole family video chats, or um, also awesome when kids are joining school remotely or for a video conference for work. Now, I feel like with all the Zoom meetings in everyone's lives nowadays, a great headset is on everybody's list. So I wanna show you this one I have right here too. This is the Anchor PowerConf H700 headset and it features AI driven noise reduction with voice shield technology and active noise cancellation, ensuring crystal clear voice and no interruptions when making calls no matter where you are. It's the world's first wireless conference headset and it's integrated with, uh, it's, it's the world's first wireless conference headset that is integrated with meeting recording and a transcription feature. If any of you listening out there have ever had to transcribe by hand, you know how long that could be. So having that built into the headset is so cool. And it also has an optional charging stand so you can get 24 hours of talk time from a single charge and then charge for five minutes for a three hour boost if need be. So these are just some of my favorite last minute tech finds this holiday season. So if you haven't gotten all your shopping done, never fear, I got you covered. <laughs> That sounds great. And, and with all of those different tech ideas, obviously, I think, uh, you know, shortages have been a big topic of concern for these past couple of weeks. How do, how do folks make sure that they get what they want to get in time for Christmas? I always say if you're not going to shop in a brick and mortar, if you're going to shop online, allow at least a week for shipping, even if it says only a few days. So I would try to get in those last minute orders within the next, you know, two to three days if you can, but you still have time. <laughs> That sounds great. Trisha, I really, really do appreciate the time. A lot of cool things um, folks can look into. Stay safe, have a great holiday, and we'll talk soon. Thank you so much, you too. And for more information on anything that I've talked about today, just go ahead and visit dailylounge.com. Happy holidays, everyone. Sounds great. Take care.